Hi, my name is Tyler, and I live in a two-bedroom apartment with my two best friends. Yeah, that's right, a two-bedroom apartment for three people. At first, we thought it was a good idea, but about six months in, we realized three people in one two-bedroom apartment, it's a bit much. Hey, who, whose tips are these? Whose? Whose are they? Yeah, that's right. Also, you can speak, by the way. You're not a dog. These are my chips. Why on earth are you eating? Kick your butt, Aiden. There you are. Hey guys, can you turn that down just a little bit? I'm trying to study. Tyler, I'm not gonna lie, dude. That sounds like a you problem. I really don't care. You decided to be the idiot that would go to college, and just because of that, I'm losing because of you. Thanks. It actually feels really nice. It's a good day today. Yeah, it actually feels really good. You wanna go out for a dog maybe later? Yeah, cause it's been cold the last couple. Of weeks. Hey guys, feel like I hate it. Y'all notice anything different about me? No. No. Anything at all? Uh huh. No. I got a haircut. You're wearing a hat. Also, no kidding, but Christmas is overdue by two months. Hello, my name's Addison. I share an apartment with uh, two people currently, and it's a two bedroom apartment, believe it or not. Do I think it's too much to share this three people in a two bedroom apartment? No, of course not. Especially when the two people you're sharing it with is your best friends. Although there might be some slight miscommunication at times. Hey, what time are you supposed to pick up Hayden from his doctor's appointment? What? Aiden's doctor's appointment. I thought you were supposed to pick him up. Uh oh. Okay, I'll go get him. No, you don't need to do that. It's a 30 minute walk. I'm sure he's fine. Yeah, probably. not want to talk about it today. I hey, freaking had a- Hayden, what happened to you? I Where freaking had a colonoscopy and I had to do potato day. God, my butt hurts. Hi, I'm Hayden and um, I'm sorry, what was the question again? And then the woman had the audacity to say it wasn't my banana. Oh, the audacity of the woman. Right? Right? Mm. Sure was freaking potato day. Man, so what do you guys make me for dinner? Um, why would we make you anything for dinner? Uh, because it was potato day? Which means out of the three of us, I had the worst shift. I don't even know where to start. Where do I start? I, I, I just hate how Hayden, he just for some reason believes that he has the toughest day out of the three of us because of the potato day. What even is potato day? What even is that? Also, Hayden works in the food industry. I work in the pharmacy and Tyler, Tyler goes to college. If anything, Tyler might have the toughest day out of the three of us, if we're being frank here. Do I have it the toughest of the three of us? I mean, I go to business school. Do what you want with that information. Hayden, I can barely make myself dinner. What makes you think I'm gonna make dinner for either you or Addison? No offense. None taken. I take all of the offense. Okay, but that's not the point. Clearly, I have it the worst out of the three of us. Well, we all, we all know that's not true. Tyler, back me up on this, dude. I don't want any part of this. You both know that. Dude. Seriously? Dude, I bet you wouldn't last 10 minutes in the pharmacy, period. Is that a bet? Yeah, it is. We'll even put money on it. I don't bet, but you're on. No, nobody's on. We're not doing that. 
That's a sitcom format that's been overused for years now. Both of you will inevitably realize that each of you has it rough in your own ways and then grow from it. And it's a tad too predictable. And to be honest, we all know we don't have the budget for that. Okay, fine. Since Tyler's so wise, we will not do it. However, I'm not going to be cooking dinner. Fine. I will just go out and get myself something to eat. Well, my day was just as tough, so I'm going to go out and eat. Just okay. Gosh. Always gotta steal my thunder. Well, you're just unbelievable. I swear. Yeah. And we can't even go out with you because you can't even unlock or lock the front door. I mean, how difficult is it to take a freaking key and twist and turn? Pretty darn hard. Clearly. Have I considered living on campus? Oh yeah, 100%. Dude, you suck at this game. I don't suck, it's just not working. It's working, you're just bad. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, it sure was potato day. Don't tell me you and Hayden went and switched jobs like I said not to. Mm. <clears throat> yeah, of course we did. Why? Also, potato day. It sucked. Okay, the Hayden's always complaining about how bad potato day is. If it's so bad, what's potato day? Hold uh, on, need another. What was the question? Okay, H Hayden's always complaining about potato day. If it's that bad, what'd you have to do? Oh, potato day. You don't even want to know, dude. It was so bad. What is potato day? Piece of cake. I don't know what you guys have been complaining about. So Hayden, how does working in the pharmacy? Piece of cake. I don't know what the big deal was. How was potato day? You know, it was okay. Potato! <gasps> I knew it. You now have potato PTSD. Okay, fine, maybe, but there, there, I know there's no way you, you had it uh, that easy in the pharmacy. There's no way. Piece of cake. There's no way that Hayden had it that easy in the pharmacy. I just need to get him to admit it. I can't, I gotta let you know, you guys know something. I can't go back there. Addison can never know. I just can't believe he had it that easily. I just can't. I don't care. I told you guys not to do this. Okay, I don't know what the heck that was, but okay, there, there's no way he had that easily. I mean, you deal with a lot of crazy people mean people in the pharmacy that takes a toll on a person i don't care again i told you guys not to do this all i'm saying is that i just can't simply understand okay why is it that you have the golf club in your hands it's because ethan keeps beating me in this stupid golf game and i want to perfect my swing by the next time we play it might be because you swing like a hockey player that's the problem and that's when yours truly figured it out on how to have Hayden confess. I know that you don't care about the thing between me and Hayden right now. Indeed, I do not. But let's say we were to spice things up a notch if we were to put money on there. You know, like just five bucks. Uh-huh. How about 10? What do you need me to do? What? I'm a jobless college student with a zero dollar a year salary. I'll do almost anything for money. How do I afford rent? My parents afford rent.
Okay, you got Tyler is uh, uh, nice. what? For real? No, of course not. Okay, you can't tell Addison this, but the uh, the pharmacy sucked. I freaking knew it. Oh, no. Pleasure doing business with you, good sir. Well, so you admit it. Pharmacy sucked. Yes, it did suck. There's no way you got through potato there that easily. No, I'll never look at a potato the same way again. So, I think you want to admit that we both have it pretty difficult and switch back to our old job? Yeah, I think that'd probably be for the best. I mean, Tyler has it pretty rough too with college and all. Again, I go to business school. I'm telling you, it's the controllers. Keep telling yourself that.